Hey everyone, how's it going? So we came back to Star Wars, The Empire Strikes Back, Episode 5, uh, that big V Roman numeral. Uh, so we went ahead and we watched uh, A New Hope, where we seen the Rebels destroy the Empire's like flagship weapon, which was the Death Star. So now in this one, I guess we're going to get the clap back of the Empire, because the Empire Strikes Back. The proof is in the pudding. So let's dive into this movie. Let's see what's going to go on. I want to find out who the hell is going to teach Luke how to use his lightsaber and, and use a force. And how is he going to practice this newfound religion? Um, Because his mentor is now deceased. Can someone explain to me how, how the lightsaber thing works? Because it seems weird. It seems like... It seems like... I can't remember his name. He got hit. Darth Vader hit him with a lightsaber and he just like vaporized instantly. Is that how that works? Or did they just do that for that one scene? And what's up with, with the VHS? Because I, I started looking into it where Jabba the Hutt was a human, which is why Han Solo was like, you're like a something human. And I was like, that doesn't make sense because he's a giant gabagool. And come to find out he was a human. And then in like the 90s, I think they did the CGI and made him into a big gabagool. So that's kind of different. Um, I didn't know that at all. Um, yeah. I kind of want to start buying some VHS tapes. I think I might do like a vlog where I go out. Because I, I, I did find a video store in Tampa, uh, Florida. Where they have like old DVDs and VHS. <laughs> old DVDs. That sounds crazy to say that. But yeah. Old DVDs and VHS um, tapes. I need to get a VHR or VHS player. Um because I want to like hunt down all the movies I'm watching. And then some movies I can't even like stream them. Like there was um, this one movie called Gummo that someone recommended for me. And I, I can't even find it online. So I, I think I'm going to start getting into like the physical collection of movies. Um, let me know if there's like a community that collects movies. Because I need to like learn. Because if it's anything like comics, I don't want to get ripped off. Anyway, without further ado, let's see how the Empire Strikes Back. Also, I have I, I downloaded that um that Star Wars game, uh the one of the new ones that came out for the Xbox. Let me know if you guys want me to live stream that, because I think I might do that. Um that that, that could be kind of fun. Anyway, let's go. A long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. Episode 5, The Empire Strikes Back. It is a dark time for the Rebellion. Although the Death Star has been destroyed, Imperial troops have driven the Rebel forces from their hidden base and pursu pursued them across the galaxy. Evading the dreaded Imperial Starfleet, a group of freedom fighters led by Luke Skywalker has established a new secret base on the remote ice world of Hoth. The evil Lord Darth Vader, obsessed with finding young Skywalker, has dispatched thousands of remote probes into the far reaches of space. It's crazy that this came out in 1980 and like they have, I don't know why I think of 1980 and I feel like they, were, they didn't have any technology <laughs> or computers. Like it seems crazy that they did this in the 80s. So these are the probes that are looking for Luke. Oh, they look like the things from Fallout. If you ever played on like Fallout New Vegas. That's so crazy. That's probably where they got the inspiration from. Or Fallout got the inspiration from Star Wars. Oh, is that young Skywalker? Oh shit, dude. What is that, a Yeti, dude? He came out of nowhere. Well, that was unexpected. Well, there's a price on my head. If I don't pay off Jabba the Hutt, I'm a dead man. They can't just give him some money to give the Jabba? What the hell, dude? Come on, man. That's right. Man, she's kind of cold. Don't get all mushy on me. So long, princess. Oh, I think he was hoping for like her to be like, don't leave. I can arrange that. You could use a good kiss. <laughs> you could use a good kiss, right? She needs to get laid. Well, I mean, if the Yeti grabbed him, he probably brought him into a cave, right? So he's probably not going to freeze. I kind of miss the snow. I used to go skiing up in Bear Mountain in New York. I only went like two or three times, but it was fun. 
That's terrifying, dude. Oh, that's his freaking horse he was riding, dude. His lightsaber is a life saver. <laughs> no. Ah, damn. Ooh. 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 There you will learn from Yoda, the Jedi Master who instructed me. Oh, this is going to be dope. Oh, maybe because he's so close to death. He was able to see, Give me a sign here. um, what's his name? Obi-Wan, right? Oh, great. How are they supposed to get out of there? Can anyone just, oh, uh, I almost smell horrific in there. So since, since he opened a lightsaber, so anyone could use a lightsaber. I thought you had to like have the force in you. Oh, that's so cool. He looks like, um. They put, I think it was Goku or Vegeta in one of those things when uh, they're in the Frieza saga. Well, I guess you don't know everything about women yet. Ooh. See, I could tell her and Luke got a thing going on, man. Han's over here hella jealous. Look at him. He's like, my man, I'm getting it in with the princess. Set your course for the Hoth system. General Veers, prepare your men. You don't talk back to him. Oof. Ooh. I remember this from one of the games where you have to like fly around their feet and like tie a rope and make them fall. That shit was so hard to do. I wonder what. It was an old like PlayStation 2 game. Whip it around, man. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. Just too many. He's like Batman, dude, <laughs> with his grapple gun. That's kind of like how he made an entrance in the first movie, where he like busts through the door. But those stormtroopers look way different. Yo, how you going? Better let his ass in. If I got out and pushed, Captain Soto. Captain Soto. <laughs> if I got out and pushed, oh, uh, why does she gotta be like that right now? You be more careful. That's kind of cool. It's kind of like the submarine thing, how they like look through the thing and the thing pops up the top. Oh shit. Bro, what you peeking at him? Yes, Admiral. <laughs> He's like, what the you want? Ooh. Hey, time to shag up, right? Let go, please. Don't get excited. Captain, being held by you isn't quite enough to get me excited. I haven't got time for anything else. Ooh. <clears throat> Holy shit. We're being watched. Oh, wait, put your weapon. I mean you no harm. Yo, he was about to blast him. Oh, he looks way different. How do I can? Like me because I'm a scoundrel. There aren't enough scoundrels in your life. I happen to like nice men. Nice men. Very nice. Damn, bro. She be kissing Luke. She be kissing Hodge. She be kissing everybody. She be kissing CP3 on next. We have a new enemy. The young rebel who destroyed the Death Star. Join us or die. Damn, why are y'all why y'all leaving R2 out in the rain, dude? How far away is Yoda? Will it take us long to get there? Not far. Yoda, not far. <laughs> He's laughing. He's trolling his ass. No, he's not far. You know, just relax. It's okay. I am ready. I Ben, I, I can be a Jedi. Ben, tell him I'm ready. Tell him, Ben. For eight hundred years have I trained Jedi. Oh. You will be. He doesn't look as cute as his baby form. I think it might be better if I stay behind and guard. <laughs> He's like, I'm just gonna chill right here. Y'all go out, y'all go out there and do your thing, you know. Oh, those are cool masks because they can't breathe in spade. That's really cool. That way they don't have to put on like a whole costume. I like that. Oh, isn't there like a meme? A meme like this? I've seen that on Instagram. If you guys want, go ahead and follow my Instagram. Oh shit, how did he get there? Or is this like a like a vision? Thank <laughs> you.
Is that him? I'm so confused. That was like like a, a premonition. But I want them alive. Oh, the bounty hunters. Oh, no we got Bubba Fett. That's the guy from the Mandalorian. The the bounty hunter. That's so cool. Oh, there goes his ship. <laughs> he said, "Cause it's Dre." Oh man! <laughs> Look at his eyes. They're like, <laughs> it's going more in the water. <laughs> it's too big. That's what she said. <laughs> Look how little I am, and I lifted it. What's your excuse? Oh shit! They're riding on top of him. That's hilarious. What a ballsy move. Someone's tailing him. Oh, Baba Fett. Yo, bring Yoda with you. Be like, come on, man. Get out the swamp for a couple days, you know? Stretch your legs. And who might you be? Leia. Damn. Okay. That's the suave meant they moving in on your lady, huh? All right. Your old smoothie. Uh, I'm terribly sorry. I, I didn't mean to intrude. No, no, no. Please don't get up. Oh, no. What the hell? I feel like they're in a room together. You know, they got privacy. They got a bed. You know? Nice view. Oh, aren't those the guys from Mandalorian who are like, I have spoken? I think those are the guys. They look just like them. I have spoken. Damn, he double crossed his ass. Oh, get a little tongue in there too. I love you. <gasps> I know. <laughs> what a douchebag. <laughs> they, they put Han Solo in a slab. It's like Darth Vader just tells you what you want to hear, but then he just does whatever he wants to do. I guess that's you know, a villain, right? You have learned much, young one. You'll find I'm full of surprises. Oh. I'm full of surprises. And then drops his lightsaber. Oh, he flew out that bitch. I mean, that was kind of easy. He just kicked Darth Vader's ass. It's just like Zelda when you enter a new boss room. Dude. I, I, maybe that's where they got it from. Ah! I am your father. I fucking knew it. That that the the first movie made it seem like he wasn't his father. That's really cool how they set this up. Or you just chopped his hand off. Why would he go with you? This guy hanging on to dear life. Meanwhile, he only got one hand. He's in crazy physical pain. He just got some psychological stuff just happening to him. He's having a really bad time right now. I'll be back. Oh, she just kiss him? So she kissed Han twice, and she kicked, kissed Luke twice in the same movie. They got like a poly thing going on. All right, guys, we just finished watching um, Star Wars. What is it? The Empire Strikes Back, Episode 5. Um, so this one we got, it was cool. We got to see Bubba Fett. We didn't see Jabba, which I thought, I thought we would have seen him because his name got brought up a bunch. And then at the end, we got Bubba Fett taking Han Solo to Jabba the Hutt to collect his bounty. And I thought we were going to see that, but I guess we're going to see that in the next movie. That should be pretty cool. Um, I like how like they leave it open-ended so there will be another sequel. Like You're waiting for the next movie. Um, I think I'll watch the next movie probably tomorrow or in like a couple days. Um, this is really cool. Um, I know what's up with Princess Leia, man, because you know, she be kissing Han. She be saying, I love you. Then she be kissing Luke. You know what I'm saying? Like, Come on, man. What you doing? You can't be doing it to both of them. You're playing games right now, man. I don't like that. Um, you know, what else we got going on in this movie? We got freaking Luke, man. He lost his freaking hand. We found out that his his daddy um is uh Darth Vader. We got to see some Yoda action. It's it's kind of funny seeing Yoda, like, because he's like an animatronic, right? Versus like the new digital Yoda that's like all the CGI. Um <laughs> there's some parts where he was like his eyes were popping out of his head <laughs> i thought that was hilarious um 
it's cool seeing him go through the training. And I like how he's training with Obi-Wan's trainer. You know what I'm saying? Like the person who taught Obi-Wan everything is trying to now pass down and teach Luke. But, you know, he had to run off because he had to save the day because uh, he is the main protagonist. So it would be a little awkward if he wasn't saving his friends because you can't turn your back on your friends, man. Um, Yeah, all around pretty good movie. Let me know what you guys think of this movie. Um, If you want to see the full reactions over on Patreon, make sure to hit the subscription button. I almost, almost hit this thing right here. Every time I hit this thing with my elbow, everything comes crashing down. It's a disaster. But without further ado, we will see you guys later. Have a good one. Peace. May the force be with y'all. I think I'll, I'll go with that exit. May the force be with you. I don't... Wow. <laughs> it's a fucking straw. Oh, man. This is a disaster. <laughs>